just done a, a test between bottled water and seven trend and not obviously knowing which was which and I preferred the seven trend water. The one I preferred was the bottled water. Well there wasn't a lot of difference between the two. I wasn't it didn't matter either way, but I did know which was which. I could tell the difference between the bottled water and the seven trend. The tap water I got. I've drunk a lot of that water all my life. I went down the mines and uh, took a gallon of bottled water with me every day. Well, I selected the orange one, the tap water, because it was just really different to the red one, and the orange one just tasted a bit better. Don't think about it, to be quite honest. No. No. I'm sorry. No. no. No, I just, took, just drink it. <laughs> just drink it as fast as I can. No, I don't think about it at all. No, not, not really. You just expect it to be good when you get it out of the tap, don't you? I have to say, I don't think about it. I accept it because I know I've got to pay for it. Um, yes, I moan when it's gone up. <laughs> um, but, yeah, I think for the service we get, yes, it, it, it's just good value. Well, I think for what I use, it's value for money. Yes, but my bill's not bad at all, but I have cut down. We're very happy with the bill we get because, obviously, as I said, I'm a big gardener, so I am aware that I probably use a little bit more. Um, and I'm quite grateful that it is metered because I think you should pay for what you use. And I think it's a way forward for people to think about how much water they're using and that they're going to pay for it. Very reasonable, very reasonable for what I use, because I, I do use a lot of water. We all do. Yeah, I Too do. much, really. It's just, you switch the tap on and it's there, isn't it? Mine's good value for the amount of people that's in mine. <laughs> yeah. For what people pay abroad to what you pay here, my son is in Australia and he pays a fifth what I pay for seven ten. All right, good water, but you pay an awful lot for it. I don't relate it to other bills because you don't get it as often, do you? It's just like once or twice a year now, isn't it? Pounds are concerned, it's good value for money, but I'm on a water meter. All right, and I just got this week from going down from £10 down to £8.50. That, that's not bad. Yes, because you use fat traps, for example, if you've got fat, you don't put them down the um, drains or, or you know, down the sink. I am aware of how much water I use and I do um, not run the dishwasher unless we've got a big family gathering. Um, I wait until I've got full loads for the washing machine. Um, don't run the tap when I'm brushing my teeth. I'm very much somebody who conserves water because I'm a gardener. So I know what it means to save water and conserve it. So for example, we recycle. If we're washing potatoes, we'll keep the water and use it for the garden. Uh, if the children are having you know, water fights or anything like that in the garden, the tap's kept to a minimum. Well, I think it's like everything. You keep putting the bills up and you see all the water leaks, and that is not on. To protect water, to save it for next generation, and another one. We need to use it wisely. Well, when there's droughts in this country, probably people will think more. I think the future is recycling your own water, having like, a, you know, let's say a, a thousand gallons, and that you, you know, someone's you know about these brown water schemes and stuff like that, you know, and being a bit more clever with it like that because there's more people in the planet every year, isn't there? And it's just getting bigger and bigger.